What is good? Welcome back to the show with Speakers Lab. The gang is back with Big and Lulu. How are we doing? Actually, I shouldn't say that. That looks like Lulu's butt right there. W Lulu, what are you doing? Anyway, guys, the whole team is back, and we're gonna do a little bit of a sneak peek. You guys know every month we've been trying to do this. A day before it actually comes into the game, we get to see the hero skin, the brand new hero skin. It's another pirate. <laughs> You guys know I'm so excited for one day. I'm hoping this happens one day I want every single hero to have a pirate skin and I don't know what you guys think about this one But I'm just happy. It's here. So guys, you know what my favorite part about this is okay Well, I mean, I guess my favorite part is the fact that we have this combo now dude This is gonna look sick. All right, let's get the pirate flag over here This is so sick, but my favorite part guys is when you put it on uh, sleep Look at the bird man. The bird actually sits in the barrel of the gun. Anyway guys, let's get the lucky hat on here Boom. Let's get shades on. Let's get everything on. Anyway, guys, this is not technically a Daytail Max video, so I'm not going to say that, but you know what I am excited to see? Is the warden actually going to shoot his, like, warden beam out of the gun? And, like, what's the bird going to do? Oh, my God. I'm so excited. Let's go. Hey, guys, check it out. I just wrote it down because I know I'm going to forget. It's code Big Day. But we're in the developer build right now. This isn't even the real game. So, I mean, can you even put a code in here? Dude, we really, really have got to get a skin for the, the new hero. And I don't even care what it is. I think, honestly, what they should do, they should do a free one. They should do a free one for everybody because not that many people have the new hero, right? The, the fourth hero. What's it actually called? The Grand Warden. I never called that. You guys know. Anyway, guys, here's the moment of truth. Let's, let's drop this thing way back here. I wonder what it's going to look like on air. Oh, my God. This is going to be so great. I, I can't wait to see this stuff. So, okay, there he is. I gotta say, man, it looks kind of cool that he's using the gun as like a walking stick and that he is carrying the bird everywhere. Like, I am... Oh my god, this is this is better than I... This is... Every single other warden has been like a beam of light, right? This is a bullet. <laughs> That's really cool, man. I love that they changed up that graphic. Yo, it's kind of like the Musketeers, right? I mean, maybe they, maybe they got sort of inspiration from the Musketeers. I don't know. Uh, th they should put the Musketeers in Clash. I think it'd be a great fit in Clash of Clans, but whatever. All right, let's go back. We got to try the air, I guess. Uh, yeah, let's try it. I just want to see what it looks like. Okay, I have not seen this yet. I'm so excited. Here we go. Let's get it way back. I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna rock this warden forever, dude. I can't imagine not having this warden. Okay. The bird alone <laughs> makes this thing so much more fun. Like, okay, did, did the bird do anything when he was on ground mode? I don't think so. I think he was just chilling, which is fine. It's fine. Where did the bird go when he was holding the gun on ground mode? Wait, let, let me go back. Let me go back. All right, guys, let's go back to ground mode. There's the pirate flag. Here we go. All right, so ground mode. Watch the bird. Dude, the bird is so great. What are we going to name the bird? I feel like his name's Hector. Oh, he just flies. He just flies for a minute. That's great, dude. That's great. Man, that is so cool. Dude, this reminds me. Some of my family lives in Key West. You guys know all the way down. The, it's like close to Cuba, right? It's like one of the most southernmost points in the United States. Uh, so my family lives there and it's it's really nice all the time. So a lot of people walk around with parrots. You know, they have, they have pet parrots that, that sometimes live longer than they do. So it's like actually a problem sometimes. People will, will pass away and somebody has to take care of their parrot because the thing's going to live another 50 years. It's crazy. Man, do you guys think if we got a parrot sometime, we could, we could uh, teach it to say, leave to for Lulu? All right, guys. So again, we're in the development build. We got you know, nothing matters here. So let's go in. Man, this is so weird having like a fresh version of the game. Like it's the development build. Nothing, nothing matters in here. All right, guys. So I think I just opened up the map. Yeah, that's what's up. When you're in the developer build, you can do stupid stuff like this. Obviously, uh, we just finished everything here. It's funny that it does it with one star though. <laughs> like what? Okay. All right. So where do you guys want to go to? Let's go into the middle forest outing. Okay. What's here? This is perfect, dude. This is so perfect. So guys, look, I brought a bunch of golems and I brought a bunch of jump spells. I just want to see this thing go around and do, do its thing, you know, shoot stuff. Here we go. This is so dope. This thing is so cool. I could actually see, okay, it's getting to the point where I think the warden 
has the best skins. Okay, so you got the Clockwork skin. The Clockwork Warden is, is definitely one of the best. Look at this pro. He's going by like, what a pro. Dude, the Warden is so great. Uh, Yeah, so do we need another jump spell here? Anyway, you guys know what I mean. There is so many good Warden skins at this point. I'll just drop these jumps everywhere. It doesn't like, it's a maze base. You know, I never really noticed. This is a really cool sort of a maze single player map. This is sick. So there's not actually a wall on this base that you need to break. No, that's funny, dude. I've never, I've never done most of these maps. I really haven't. Like, it's kind of cool to see them. It's really cool to see the golems running around this. It's like a pretty trippy maze. Have you guys done these? I mean, I, I, I think most people have done these single player maps. I just sort of, I don't know. Halfway through, I stopped, stopped doing them. Uh, anyway, guys, let us know what you think. I think if you are a collector of the skins, which like, I'm just trying to collect them all, even the ones I don't like, right? I know not everybody does that. Not everybody can do that. Uh, but I, I like the fact that, you know, you would think that the queen would get all the love, right? The queen would get the best skins. It doesn't seem to be the case. The queen has some awesome skins. I don't know. The warden's kind of killing it too. Look at all these skeletons. <laughs> What's the bird doing? That's my dude. You know what? Oh, let's hit the ability. Oh, it doesn't do anything cool. You know what would have been cool is when he, if he did the ability, the bird like flew around him and feathers flew everywhere. Like, come on, let's get some random stuff like that, you know? Cool. Uh, there might be a sound effect, actually. I wonder if there's sound effects for this. I, I really can't have the sound effects on. Um, yeah, they drive me nuts. <laughs> All right, guys, get ready for the ultimate pirate attack. We're going to try to go up against the golden dragon. Now, I think we got to use the pirate queen as well, but that's going to be a sick combo. I think it's going to look really cool. I wish, man, I wish more heroes or more hero skins had like a separate, like the fact that this, this warden has a bird following him around. Can you imagine the queen, like a wolf queen? So she's got a pet wolf or like, wait, what am I saying? A bunny queen and she's got a pet bunny roaming around with her. Anyway, guys, shades on. Shades on for the dragon. Here we go. Let's get this dude out of there. Um, there's a ton of traps in this base. I should have brought some poison spells. It's all good. All right, here we go. This is such a nightmare. Oh my God. All right, here we go. Queen first. Now the warden. Yo, this is so cool. Oh, this, I love this. I love this. I'm gonna drop another golem. I'm gonna keep the golems going. I'm gonna drop two. Maybe, yeah. All right, let's zoom out. Dude, look at him go. They're actually gonna kill this thing. And like, yeah, most of the work is being done by the queen because she's a max queen, she's an incredible queen. But look, I mean, the warden's doing stuff too. Look at those golems. <laughs> All right, get it, buddy. All right, now let's get some more in here. Here we go. We'll just drop them jumps everywhere. Just do your thing, gang. Oh, queen, why you? Okay, do your thing. This is so funny, dude. This is so funny. So yeah, man, when you are at this level and you have these heroes, they're so powerful. They're so powerful. This is why I tell you guys always to like max your heroes because look at how stupid. I mean, this is a bad example because this isn't a real base, but look at what these heroes can do like on their own. I mean, it's crazy. Anyway, guys, uh, I love this. I absolutely love the fact that we're going to eventually, I think, end up with at least three. I mean, what's the king going to look like? Maybe the king is actually going to be the captain. I was hoping that one of them would have, and I honestly thought the warden would have this. I, I was expecting one of them to have a... Oh my God, I always forget that. Oh my God. Anyway, guys, let me look real quick. I want to see chain skin. Man, so the warden is really lagging behind. Like he does not have that many skins. I thought he had more than this. And then you go there. <laughs> and then you had to go there and see, I mean, her face looks so sad. Oof. Lulu, what's going on? Wait a minute. He's got, he's, he's got an eye patch, but he doesn't need it. You guys ever hear the story about the one time I needed an eye patch? I got glass in my eye. Yeah, I was breaking a bottle. I So I... I'm not gonna tell you the details, but I had this fancy bottle. I didn't know how to open it. And so I smashed it on a, a metal railing. Glass got in my eye. Had to go to the hospital. Had to wear an eye patch for a while. Really cool. 
I think I actually had to go to high school with an eye patch on for a while. I truly wish there were pictures of that, and I don't think there is. I think I was probably too embarrassed. Lulu, you're freaking us out. Anyway, guys, that is going to be it for today. Thank you for coming out. We love you guys. If you enjoyed this one, be sure to let us know in the comments below. Leave it to you for Lulu. If you're excited about the pirate, you know, I'm not even going to say it's just the pirate warden. If you're excited about the fact that this clearly means we're going to have a bunch of pirate skins, at least, you know, this and the pirate king, I would say. Right. And I love when they do the groups. I love when they do the groups like the clockwork. The, the gladiator was the best. Right. Every one of the gladiator skins is good. You know, it may not be your favorite, but it's pretty good. Anyway, let us know how you're doing in the comments below. Leave two for Lulu. Join the gang. Use code Beak. All that good stuff. And we will see you guys right here tomorrow on Beaker's Lab for a brand new season. Dude, that's kind of what's weird about this when we do these sneak peek videos because it's like it's like the reset day before we have a new season, right? All right, gang, we'll see you guys then for 87 days till max. Peace, gang.